Hello everyone. So in the previous lecture, we just configured and wrote many user defined functions for communicating 25AA 160A EEPROM with our microcontroller PIC16 of 877A using SPI bus. So in this lecture, we will write the program for the communication. So, so these are the functions that I explained in the last lecture. SPI write is used for writing data to the SPI bus and this SPI read is used for re reading from the SPI bus and this write to 25 will write the data to the E from 25AA 160A and this read from 25 will read the data from the E from. I explained this and I explained all these four functions in the previous lecture. If you have any doubts, you can go back to that lecture for better understanding. And inside the main, I have configured the GPIO of the microcontroller that is only the MISO pin of the microcontroller is made as input and all the other pins, serial clock, MOSI and slave select pin are made as output. This also we did in the last lecture. And in the previous lecture, I just mentioned this as SSPCon1 register, but this is not applicable. So I am writing it as SSPCon. This is a small correction. Please make it. And under that, I am performing the write enable sequence for the EEPROM that we checked in the data set of 25W160A in the previous lecture. I explained this too in the last lecture. And after that, I am just writing to the EEPROM that is the MSP of the address, LSP of the address, and this is the data to be written. So I am going to the 030x0343 address of the EEPROM and I am writing the data 09. After that, I am performing the sequence for write disable operation. This also we saw in the last lecture. And after that, we are reading from the address 0x0343. So MSB is 03 and LSB is 43. So I am reading from the same address. I must get the data 09. So that's all about the program. I am building this project. Now when I try to run the simulation, SP debugger will come. So using that debugger, we can visually see the data that is being transferred or received to one from the microcontroller. If you are not seeing the SPA debugger, go to debug and click on terminal. This is the SPA debugger and here you can see firstly 06 which is nothing but the write enable sequence is sent. This arrow mark indicates the data that is sent from the microcontroller and this reverse arrow mark indicates the data that is coming to the microcontroller. And secondly, we are sending the data 02034309. This is the right sequence. And thirdly, we are sending the sequence 04, which is the right disable sequence. And after that, we are sending the data 030343. And here you can see 09 is coming to the microcontroller that is indicated by this arrow. So once we send this data 030343, the data that is present in the address 0x0343 that is 09 is being transmitted from the EEPROM. So that will be stored in the variable A that we can use for further processing. So this is how you can interface 25AA160A to your microcontroller PIC16 of 877A using SPA bus.